Hi everybody, welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. So lately I have had too, too many requests to do a Dollar Tree haul. I've actually never done one before. I've only been to the Dollar Tree a couple times in like my whole entire life, but I'm doing it. I got a whole bunch of goodies and I cannot wait to show you. Woo! This bag is jam packed with all of the cutest little things. Let's start this. And here we go. Whoa. I was amazed how I just went into the Dollar Tree, spent about $20, and got all of this stuff. <laughs> it is just so amazing. I have everything from little toys, to lip glosses, bubbles, nail polish, you name it. Here we go! So the first things up are these cool, stretchy dough balls. Now when I first saw them, I thought they were kind of like slimy ones, but they actually do feel like dough. <laughs> it's so weird. It's like I have a little ball of Play-Doh in my hand. I have never felt a little squishy ball like this. And I got a pink one, neon green, and neon orange. They are the coolest colors. Let's open them, get a closer look. Our three little dough balls are lined up. Now these are super amazing to me and let me tell you why. <laughs> when you look at them, they just look like rolled up pieces of Play-Doh. They look, they feel exactly like it. They don't feel like regular slime balls and they stretch so much. And when I stretch them out, I think there actually is dough in here, like some kind of Play-Doh. These are so, so cool. They have the best feeling ever. If you look at the corner of this when you start squishing it up, I think there's actually like white Play-Doh inside. <laughs> Usually when you buy these balls, they're like slime and putty, but this is so much different and it feels completely different too. You can mold it a little, bend it. I could really, really play with these all day. <laughs> they're just so fascinating. Look at this. Then we get the green. Look at that, it just makes these weird shapes, then it stretches out. And the pink one, ooh, this one's really pretty. I am so, so happy I stopped at the Dollar Tree yesterday, otherwise I never would have found these adorable little dough balls. They are so, so much fun and squishy. And if you guys have like a Dollar Tree near your house, I really recommend you go and get these. They're so, so much fun. Look, they even stick together. You can mash them, you can stretch them. Love these. Ooh, how about a little dollar stationery? This notebook and pen was only a dollar. It's so, so cool. And the best part about it, it is scented. I wonder what it's gonna smell like. <laughs> it kind of looks like one of the monsters in Monsters, Inc. Cute little cupcake with sprinkles, but she's got one big eyeball and some fangs. I bet this is gonna smell super chocolatey. Let's test it. Ooh, and the pen is so cute. It's got this little flower hanging. It looks like it's brown sparkle ink. Here's the notebook. Let's smell it. Whoa, I thought this was gonna be smelly, kind of like a scratch and sniff sticker, but it is so, so strong. You don't even really have to scratch it. It smells like chocolate fudge or chocolate frosting. Really, really good. If you brought this to school, I think the kids in your class would smell something sweet. They'd have no idea it was the notebook. Here we go, it's got lines. I don't think this is for doing homework, just taking little notes. You can use it as like a little diary. Too, too cute. It's a close up of a little matching pen with that flower charm, and I love how they did the brown ink. Kind of is gonna look like chocolate. Let's write something. There it is, it's all brown and sparkly. Looks like I wrote it in chocolate. And the best part about this is the pen is also scented too. Ah, it smells just like chocolate ice cream. Cutest little stationery set ever. Boop. 
Another cool thing that I didn't realize about the Dollar Tree was that it has beauty products. I don't know why, I've been there a couple times. I think I got some party decorations and a couple little toys. But when I saw that they had lip balm and they had different shampoos and nail polishes, I went crazy. So here we go, I got three of them. First one up is this LA Colors Lip Balm. Now when you look at this, it looks like a baby lips. <laughs> it's got the same shape and kind of decorations. I guess it's like the Dollar Tree kind, and I'm sure it's gonna be amazing. The color is so, so pretty. It's kind of a minty green, and it's got that purple. Ooh, and it's so funny, it says Color Balm. Wonder if it's gonna give any color. It just looks so pretty. Look at that, it looks fake. Looks like a little piece of plastic. Ooh, and it does, wow. Look at that purplish pink color, I love that. Kind of matches with my nails a little bit. This is probably just as good as the Baby Lips, and Baby Lips are like usually $5. This was one, 99 cents. <laughs> I gotta get more of these, they're really, really good. Really moisturizing, has great color. That's a good find. Ooh, and I was really surprised to see that they sold Revo lip balms there. Look how cute this is. It's actually a new shape. It's a push-up. I have never had one of these before, and it's strawberry flavored, vitamin E and aloe, and it was only a dollar, which is so, so cool. I usually spend like three or four dollars for these. See, ooh, look at that cute little shape. It looks like a little honey jar. So I think all we do is just twist the top. There it is. Mmm, smells so, so good. Just like a regular lip balm, really soft and moisturizing, and I guess you just push it from the bottom. That is too, too awesome. The refills that I have kind of look like EOS's. This is such a different shape, and I guess when you want to put it down, you just push it. And when you want to apply, it goes right up. Kind of like a mini lipstick. Really, really like that one. Mm, such a really good scent. It's not like a regular chapstick. The strawberry scent is really, really good. Super sweet. Mm. The last beauty product I bought at the Dollar Tree was this Milani Sparkle Polish. Look at this polish. I always love to wear these little sparkly clear ones over the color. And this has so, so much shimmer. It's got all different ones, reds, pinks, purple. And it was such a reasonable price. <laughs> 99 cents, usually those I, that I buy are like five or six dollars. So this was a really, really good deal. Look how much that shimmers. And this is a super big bottle. It will last you for a pretty long time. Let's test it. Ooh, it looks like a little bottle of jewels. <laughs> super, super pretty. Ooh, wow, this is filled with glitter. Looks like funfetti sprinkles on a cupcake. Look at all of the confetti and glitter on there. You could wear this alone. <laughs> Your nails will look like a little birthday party. Or you could wear them on top of like a light white or a pink or a yellow, pretty much any color. Wow, I do have tons of like confetti polishes, but this is probably the best one I've seen. Look at all of that. Here's another look at those three beauty finds. I loved all of them. Let's root around in this bag. There's still so much more. Ooh, bubbles. We have, if you can believe this or not, some soda pop scented bubbles. <laughs> they actually are supposed to smell like soda. They are in these amazing little bottles. I had to get two packs of them just so I can get all six of the different colors. Look at this one. This really looks like Coke or Pepsi. This one looks like a Cherry Crush. So many different scents going. Let's try them. Here's the first three up. So we get a green, orange, and a blue one. These bottles, <laughs> they are too, too cute. And I'm curious if they're all gonna smell the same or if they're gonna have like fruity soda scents. Unbelievable. See? Ooh, and the little cap is a little bubble wand. Mmm, you know what? This smells like spray. It's kind of like a lemon lime scented. Oop, and they work. These are perfect for like little birthday party favors. See, ooh, and I love this bright color top. <laughs> they are so, so real looking. Mmm. 
This one smells like orange, but not too strong. Not as strong as the lemon lime one. Ooh, I love bubbles. This one didn't smell too great. I'm hoping this smells maybe like blue raspberry. I hope it smells a little bit different. Mmm, and it does. <laughs> it smells just like raspberry. Good one. On the package, the scents were lime, orange, and blueberry. Here's the next three up, and the flavors are strawberry, cola, ooh, and grape. I am most excited to smell the cola one. I wonder if it's gonna smell like Coke or Pepsi. Here's the red, mmm, this looks really good. Kinda looks like Hawaiian punch in there. These are kinda making me thirsty. Mmm, does smell like strawberry. This probably has the best scent yet. And for the cola, <laughs> I wonder how this is gonna smell. It looks like soda, especially when you shake it. You see all those little bubbles in there? Let's see. It does, <laughs> it really does. Kind of smells like root beer. It has a faint smell of Pepsi or something. But more like root beer. That is so, so cool. Here is the six of the soda pop bubbles. And this is a super pretty purple. Mmm, this is gonna be great. Whoa. <laughs> this is the winner so far. Mmm, this smells so good. This smells like pure grape soda. I don't smell the other ones. There is a little soapy kind of bubble smell. This one, no, it is so, so good. I wish you could smell it. Here's all six of them, and if I didn't know they were bubbles, I would think they were little teeny bottles of juice or soda. They are too, too precious looking. And the best scent was definitely the grape one. Everybody, woohoo! Look what I found. They also have these little gag jokes. They are too, too cute. So we have three of them. One of them is called Ketchup Spill. You can like trick your friends. Maybe you could put this on their laptop or their little TV and make it like you spilled the ketchup. This one, rubber pencil. I guess you can bend it. This one is so, so funny. Chewed up gum. Look at that little wad of gum there. You could put it in your friend's backpack or something like that and they would go crazy. Let's open these. Let's start with the ketchup spill. I always love a good practical joke or a little gag to pull on somebody, and this is the perfect one. Now take a quick look at this and tell me it does not look real. This looks like you actually just slammed a package of ketchup and it just squished out everywhere. It is so surrealistic so looking. Look how shiny that is. Unbelievable. This is just kind of like a plastic piece. Kind of looked like a putty when I first saw it or some slime, but it's just hard plastic. You could slip this on your best friend's desk when they're not looking at school. If they get up and go somewhere, when they come back, you can have it all over their homework or their notebook. It is just too, too funny. Looks so, so real. And it was only a dollar. What do we have here? It's called a rubber pencil. Mm. This is probably like a trick bendy one. I think I've seen these before. Well, it definitely looks like your ordinary average pencil, like you're about to start writing, but look at that. <laughs> it is super bendy, probably the bendiest little pencil ever. Such a weird material, it's kind of like a rubbery plastic, but then it goes back to like the regular shape. This is perfect if one of your classmates asked you if you had an extra pencil and you gave this to them. They would just be like, what is this? <laughs> it is too, too funny. The last one up of our little joke tricks here is chewed up gum. <laughs> when I first saw this package, I was just amazed by those pretty gumballs. And when I took a closer look, I was like, ew, what is that? It looks like a wad of gum. I don't know if it's salt and like jelly lake. Let's see this. Ew. Would you look at this, you guys? This is probably the most realistic chewed up gum you're ever gonna find, just besides a regular piece of gum. It is kind of squishy, it's a little bit sticky, it looks so, so real. And the best part about this is when you flip it over, it has this really strong adhesive sticker on there. Ah, where is it? Here it is, it's 
so sticky, so you can actually stick it to something. I have a good idea. I think later I'm gonna stick this to my sister's little iPhone. <laughs> she is gonna go crazy. She's gonna think I really put some gum on there. But I have a better idea for this one. How about, it would be so funny if I got one of her lip glosses and like stuck it right on there. <laughs> Look at that. She would be like, what is going on? Too, too funny. Here's the three of our little trickety tricks and I loved all of them. I think the best one was the spilt ketchup. Then I like the gum and the bendy little pencil. But you can't leave the Dollar Tree without picking up some candy. They sell so, so many different kinds there. And I got two different ones. Now this is so, so cute. It says a princess lollipop and it looks exactly like Aurora. It's not a Disney princess one, but <laughs> she has her hair and eyes and dress. So, so pretty. It's actually too pretty to even eat. But I think we're going to unwrap it and take a little lick. And I also found this mega pack of Superman Taffy Bars. Look at all of these. There's so many. This was just one dollar. I couldn't even believe it. <laughs> we have cherry, mystery flavor. Ooh, the mystery flavor. Strawberry, blue rasp, sour apple. So you get one, two, three, four, five different flavors. You get ten all together. Let's test this out. Let's start with the little princess lolly. Ooh, she's got such a fancy little dress with ruffles. There are too, too many details on this. <laughs> it's so beautiful. I don't know how they did it with all that sugar. Ah! Here it is. Well, that definitely looks like Aurora to me. I do not know. Look at the skin color and her dress, her hair. I don't know how they got all of this detail in there. Well, this princess looks like she fell in a bucket of oil. I was taking a little lick. She's so shiny now. This is delicious. I was a little skeptical. I didn't think it would taste so good, but it tastes just like a really good strawberry. The hair tastes like strawberry. It's all one flavor. Mmm, yummy. Ah, but once you start licking it a little bit more, she starts looking a little bit scary. <laughs> Let's move on to the next one. Ooh, look at this mega Superman pack. <laughs> it's got all of these flavors. So, here's the mystery one. See what flavor that's gonna be. And I love, <laughs> these little packages look just like comic books. Ooh, it's kind of like a pinkish color. Ooh. Mm, definitely watermelon. I'm just a little confused though. It tastes like taffy, but it's kind of hard. Just like a hard candy that you would suck on. I don't think you could really chew this. But it tastes really good. Let's look at the blue rest. Ooh, that's the blue one. Mm, ooh, this one tastes better. This is really, really good. Oop, and it breaks apart. <laughs> Strawberry one. I always thought taffy was supposed to be like chewy and bendy. This one is a little bit harder, but it, it really, really does taste good. Ooh, this is kind of a different color. It's a little bit darker. Mmm, ooh, that one I don't like too much. I like the blue one better. Hey, how about the green apple? Take a little lick. Ooh, green apple is good too. Love that. And the last one is the cherry. So all the red ones and pink ones are exactly the same color. <laughs> Out of all of these, I like the blue the best. Although these are not the yummiest taffies I've ever had, they could have made them a little better. So there's still two more goodies left and I have had a little bit of everything. Some candy, some beauty, little tricks and toys. And I have a dolly. This is a cute little doll. She comes with little furniture. Look at this desk. It's not the greatest little doll place up, but it was only $1 and it is super cute. Look at her little face. Let's put it together. Here's all this little stuff. So out of the package, here's our little dolly. She is really, really cute. Kind of small with this super bright yellow hair. Love all of her little makeup. And this outfit is such neon colors. It's like light yellow with little white flowers. This neon orange skirt. The skirt kind of matches a little dough ball. <laughs> it's the same exact color. And she's got little pink shoes. I love those colors. I wish I had my own outfit that looked like that. 
She also comes with this little dolly desk. How cute. It's got all this little detail, little notebook and school supplies on there. It's got all these little shelves. So we have that. We have that little purple chair and these cute little beauty accessories. This looks like a bottle of perfume. What else is there? Ooh, like a little desk lamp. These look like Barbie accessories a little bit. You could actually use them for your Barbies. This looks like a bottle of <laughs> either Windex or some type of cleaning. That's cute. And ah, what else do we get here? Ooh, doesn't want to stay. This looks like it could be some perfume or some kind of makeup. This doll is really cute, but the only part I don't like about her too much is she doesn't stand on her own and she doesn't sit. <laughs> so unless you're playing with her, she's she's just falls down. Ah, here's everything together, all of these cute little things, and our final little surprise of the day is some ice cream bubbles, <laughs> some more scented ones. These are so so cool, and I even think it's in the shape of a popsicle. Let's open it up and see it. Oh, that is so adorable. Look at that pink color. It's got a little popsicle stick. Let's test this baby out. Whoa. And it smells. It smells like strawberries and cream. It does have an ice cream scent. Love that. Who would want an ice cream popsicle bubble? So there it is guys, all of our Dollar Tree things. So many different ones from candy to bubble, stationery. And out of all of the things here and play after playing with them, I definitely think I like these dough balls the best. <laughs> they just never fail to amaze me. They are super stretchy, they are not messy at all, and they feel like little pieces of Play-Doh in your hands. Really, really fun. We are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day. Bye.